in the throes of the Second World War, as the world was grappling with the onset of modern warfare, a groundbreaking development was taking place in the heart of Germany. It was the late 1930s and the German military complex was working feverishly to gain an upper hand in the conflict spreading across the globe. In this milieu, the Henschel HS 293 was born, a guided missile that would leave a significant mark on the history of warfare. Henschel, an established German engineering company, was no stranger to the demands of the war machine. With a robust history in locomotive and steam engine production, they were well equipped to take on the challenge of producing a new kind of weapon. The HS 293 project was initiated in 1940 under the guidance of the company's chief designer, Herbert Wagner. The missile was envisioned as an anti-ship weapon designed to be launched from a bomber at a safe distance and guided to its target by a controller aboard the aircraft. The HS-293 was a radio-controlled glide bomb, a pioneering example of what we would now call a drone. The first successful test of the HS-293 took place in 1941, but it was not until 1943 that the missile saw its first combat use. The maiden combat mission was executed on the 25th of August, 1943, when a German aircraft carrying an HS-293 attacked the British warship HMS Egret, marking the first sinking of a ship by a guided missile in history. The HS-293 continued to be used extensively in the Atlantic and Mediterranean theatres, proving to be a formidable weapon against Allied shipping. However, due to the rapid advancement of electronic warfare technology by the Allies, the effectiveness of the HS-293 began to diminish towards the end of the war. Despite this, the HS-293 left an indelible mark on the evolution of warfare. It was a forerunner in the development of remote-controlled weapons, opening the door to the modern era of unmanned combat systems. To summarize, the Henschel HS-293 was a product of the Second World War, developed by the German engineering company Henschel in the late 1930s. It was a pioneering guided missile designed to attack ships from a safe distance. The HS-293 was first used in combat in 1943, marking the first sinking of a ship by a guided missile. Despite its eventual decline in effectiveness due to the advancement of enemy technology, the HS-293 remains a significant milestone in the history of warfare, paving the way for the development of modern unmanned combat systems. And with that, we close the chapter on the Henschel HS-293, a missile that changed the face of warfare and left a lasting imprint on the annals of military history.